So it's Monday morning and I am just about to do my morning routine. I have everything set up. I unfortunately can't put my little blanket down that I usually put down because somebody's claimed it. But I am just about to do some meditation. I am also going to write in my journal and do the exercise from this Raise Your Vibration. Obviously, I love my iCal and I'm so excited when I look at it and I see a week that is this full. I have so many calls, I'm pretty sure, with, with podcast interviews and catch-up calls and client calls. I've got like 15 calls this week, but it's so exciting and I've got some other amazing projects that I'm going to be working on. Oh, I don't know. I freaking love my job, guys. up my kind of morning calls I had three calls three client calls which was amazing I'm pretty exhausted now to be honest you know you get to the point where I'm, I speak so quickly so I wind myself essentially so I'm gonna go have some lunch chill out probably practice the guitar and then I'm gonna redo my vision board today because I don't know feeling a little bit disconnected to it got some amazing things I'm gonna be working on so hashtag entrepreneurial life I freaking love honestly just being able to do what I want when I want I know I have client calls but it's also just being like, mm, okay, I'm tired now. I'm going to go do something a little bit more low key. So this is possible for you guys. If this is the life that you want, you can absolutely make it happen. I just want to remind you that. He's not furling very well. He just vomited everywhere as I was recording. Poor little guy. Now he's just like standing there. No. Oh. Sorry, it's so dark because it's so early, but I am just about to go on and do a podcast interview of probably one of my favorite authors of all time. I'm so excited about this. I am so freaking nervous as well, but. Actually, the podcast will be out two days after this video, so if you're not subscribed, go subscribe because it's going to be an awesome interview. Javi, sit down. Sit down. Hey, sit down. Javi, sit down. Do you want to go for a walk? Do you want to go for a walk? Do you want to go for walkies? Walkies? Is that where you want to go? Is that where you want to go? So the interview's done. I think it was incredible. No, it was really good and I'm so excited for you to hear it. I'm going to go work in a cafe now because I've got a big exciting project that I am working on and my house is just not giving me the creative inspiration I need. So cafe days it is. <laughs> Recording me while I'm trying to vlog yeah, and making it really embarrassing. This is <laughs> so much concentration. What are we working on today, Kimberly? So today I'm working on my book and my membership site, and we're working on goals. Got my chai with me. Love it. <laughs> Love it. I need to get some better photos though, because like I have, I really like like the style of those photos. But George and I took it on a day that was like 
pissing down rain so it was like so black so like i see that in the actual feed they do look a bit dark maybe maybe not as many colors as there could be to be eye-catching or contrasting colors i should say but yeah no i like definitely having them more like as you said um like lifestyle stuff even for like the business bar instead of actually having me with like a beverage have it something based on the topic of the the video Day now I'm just about to jump in it's about 6 30 in the morning but I have ahead of me a client call then a podcast interview then another client call then another client call then I'm gonna try squeeze in recording a podcast depending on how the the throat's going you could say um, I tend to wind myself a lot when I talk for too long because I don't breathe when I talk let's just face it so I'll see how I go with that I was supposed to have a networking event tonight really excited about it realized it was last night Dang. But I have an exciting project I'm working on, so I'll probably get to smash some of that out later. So that was like a pretty intense session. I ended up having a client call and then a podcast interview with my coach, who's freaking amazing. That will be out. In a couple of weeks, her name's Natalia Benson. I'm going to leave her in for down below. You definitely need to follow her. But I had that and then another client call. So I'm going to clear the energy, do a little bit of meditation, midday medi, you want to call it, before I jump onto another client call in about an hour. <laughs> I'm just about to pull a card from this deck and since my morning routine so many people asked me what I use tarot for or if I could talk about tarot or oracle cards and things like that. In all honesty I'm like not even nearly close to being a professional when it comes to tarot or anything like this but the coach of mine that I just mentioned well my coach that I just mentioned Natalia Benson she is the one that is teaching me tarot she's the one that reads my tarot. Are you serious bro? Like come on. Um <laughs> She's the one that reads my tarot, so definitely go follow her if you'd like to learn more. She does, like, Facebook lives, I mean, Instagram lives where she does tarot. I can't even deal with this guy. Seriously? Seriously? Have you sit down. Sit down, please. Sit down. Javi, sit down. Shake my hand. Shake. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. There's no gatekeeper, there's no there's no limit to your success, but at the end of the day, networking is still a huge part of this particular industry. It's not one of those industries where just sitting behind your computer, you're just going to be able to attract, you know, all of the business in the world. You have to participate in within this industry and have your name known because there is still structure to this industry. So like, that's not a bad thing. I don't want you to think, oh, it's not going to be as easy for me as like a health coach or something. But I think that it's just so important that you recognize like the paths that are going to get you to success and don't be looking at the business coaches beside you or the spiritual coaches beside you and actually thinking about, well, I've got to network my way in and get my name out there. And that's what's going to create the success for me. That's what's going to bring me the opportunity. <laughs>
So my client in-person meeting is done for the day. Just recorded some podcasts. Desk is now messy AF. But I mean, it's a pretty good Thursday afternoon. I just did a tarot reading to ask a question about a very big project that I am working on, a very exciting one, and it was positive AF. It was like one of those good old ticks. Um, But yeah, I'm really excited about that. Pretty much just going to chill working on that particular project for the rest of the day. But however, however... Let me just flip it around so we can get serious. I did actually do a live today, so you can go back and find it. Today's Thursday the 5th or something like that, in the May Collective Facebook group, all about the one thing you might not be doing in your business that could produce amazing results for you. So if you're watching this, go find that, get onto what I said to do, and then thank me later. (laughs) 